in the region. Well, I don't think the admirals were in wingtips this morning, but Admiral, uh, you said a few moments ago that the fall of Ramadi is neither Bull Run nor Gettysburg and that we could still do this. My question is, who is the we mm -hmm. and how is, how is it possible to still do this in your estimation? Well, from a military perspective, what we want to do is take the fact that the ISIS has the central position which they're exploiting at the moment, going to the north, coming to the south, operating in the desert to the west. We want to put them under a three-axis campaign of pressure. That's Peshmerga coming from the north. We need to arm them, as the congressman said. The bombing campaign going after their logistics, their bases in the west and in Syria. And we've got to get the, we've got to get the uh, Iraqi security forces in the game. And we've got to find an accommodation to work with the Shia militias, not Iran, but the Shia militias, and I'm encouraged by what the congressman said. I think if we put them under three-axis pressure, we've got a, a militarily viable strategy. In terms of the we, I think we also need to get uh, the Turkish allies, NATO members who need to play more, especially in and approach the Jordanians about being very involved in the training mission. We need more boots on the ground from the U.S., not 100,000, but probably 10,000. If we do all those things, Joe, I think we have a reasonable shot at this.